Okay, so this property is in St George. It's been completely refurbished. Everything's been painted, new windows, new doors, and time uh, new first floor layout. We actually know the street very well, and is actually uh, this is this is a completely proposed new layout. Um, unfortunately, they're where they have uh, completely dry lined all the exterior walls of the property. It's actually really hard to see that there's uh, any issues here. Walls look pretty good, and then we use the thermal imaging camera. So we're bringing up the thermal imager, and can you see those? Um, those spots that we can see on the thermal imaging camera, those are obviously where the plasterboard has been dot and dabbed to the walls. The issue we've got here is that now the uh, dot and dab, the, the dab part of the dot and dab is now acting as a, as a wick between the internal plasterboard and the, um, and the uh, external masonry wall. Uh, we've used a pole camera, we can actually see this, the quality of the render on the other side of the wall is absolutely appalling. Uh, but again, you can see the start here is these much darker dots, which is the dot and dab that we can use to see through using a thermal imager.